Now, I wanted to show you a couple of neat things with WordPress. If you want to spend a little bit of money and you want to add some additional items for your WordPress blog, uh, simply by selecting the Upgrades tab from your uh, dashboard, it will bring you over where you could actually add your own customized domain name. So uh, for $5, you can get your own URL. A career at Mayfield.com, and then they would map that for an additional nine dollars and ninety-seven ninety-seven cents. So um, you could you can go to this page. You can add additional uh, video inf video information, customized CMS. Um, if you don't want any ads around your your blog, because occasionally WordPress does put some ads around various blogs, I don't see that very often at all so I wouldn't panic about that but that is how they make their money but uh, if you don't want ads to pop up around your blog you simply can buy that subscription for twenty nine dollars and ninety seven cents a year and then if you need some space upgrades where you want to add more video you want to add more documents more information very reasonably priced but um, one of the neat things is being able to have a customized URL now I'm going to go up here and just type in Farmington Mo Homes. That is a customized URL that I have. And if you'll notice, my customized URL actually goes then to farmingtonmohomes.wordpress.com. Here's one of the polls I was telling you about that I put on my uh, blog website earlier, which is what do you, uh, what's your favorite thing about Farmington, Missouri? And so you, I'm actually, that's a post and I am have that as a poll on my website. I actually have over here on the right um, listings from my Flickr account. So my listings from Flickr actually pull over automatically, kind of the same uh, principle that the VODPOD videos we were talking about do with VODPOD. I'm doing the same thing with Flickr on my website. I've created some various things and actually going to have a video for you on how to create a um, kind of a marketing recap research with PowerPoint and inserting that with YouTube and on your on your uh, WordPress site. So lots of things you can do with WordPress. Now I wanted to point out that we typed in farmingtonmohomes.com and it actually went to my WordPress account. Basically, all I do in that case is register my URL from my uh, from the provider where I purchase my domain name. In my case, I purchased it from GoDaddy. So once I purchased my domain name, FarmingtonMoHomes.com, I go into my GoDaddy account. I look up that domain name I just purchased and there's a little button there called forward and I click that forward button and I point it right up here to farmingtonmohomes.wordpress.com now why I do that is it's free it doesn't cost me anything and you know if I wanted to spend an extra $10 I could do that by mapping it, but I don't know how many people really go up there and pay attention. If you're advertising your website as Farmington Mo Homes or whatever it is, you can continue to advertise that. And as people type in that web address, GoDaddy will forward it on over for free. So I just wanted to show you the fact that you have both options. You can register and map that for an additional fee or you can go to the place that you registered your domain name and then just point it to your WordPress account. So I hope you enjoyed some of these videos on how you could create a free recruiting website through WordPress. I uh, appreciate your support with the Council of Real Estate Brokers and Managers. Be sure and check us out at www crb.com. We have lots of webinars, lots of information for you to take advantage of. And if, if you're a real estate broker and manager and you are not a member of the Council of Real Estate Brokers and Managers, 
please check us out, crb.com. We have some great classes that can help you grow your business, lots of resources, and we'd love to have you as a member as well. So these are videos on how to create a recruiting website through wordpress.com. I hope you enjoy the videos and I hope you have a great time creating your new free website. Get as creative as you want. We talked about a recruiting website, but you could create a website for your own agents. You could create really a company website uh, or, a, or a city website as I've done with Farmington, Missouri. Yeah, you could create a website for training. Just uh, have fun, get creative, and let me know if I can help in any way. My name is John Mayfield. I'm the 2010 president for the CRB, and my email address is john at realestatetechguy.com. Check me out at realestatetechguy.com. Check us out at the CRB, and have fun creating your new web blog recruiting website. Thanks so much.